Rose here from the Wolf Hunters. We have a reaction video for you. Our social media platforms are below in the description box. You can find our website down there too and this link which is where you can submit your reaction request. Today's video is brought to you guys by God Mod Good. Bringing us rabbit by Chaz and Dave. Godwood Corngood says, Anti Valentine's Day 2023 series two of six. Father had an old vinyl single of this. Mother didn't like it. Anyway, Chaz and Dave were an English rock pop duo from Middlesex formed in 1972. And this song came out as a single in 1980 and was a top 10 hit in the UK. A couple points on the lingo. Rabbit is cockney rhyming slang for talk. And Sainsbury's is a big supermarket chain in the UK. During World War II, when meat was rationed, there arose a saying in Cockney parts of London, You've got more rabbit than Sainsbury's. Sainsbury's. The rest is pretty straightforward, though maybe Travis will be better off pretending it's done. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, y'all. Hit the like button, subscribe. That guy water can't go below. Hit. I already said that part. Yep. 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 Heard the sound of laughter. That's actually what I say to Susie when I wake up in the morning is, man, you've got a beautiful chin. She's like, oh, thank you so much. Yeah, because I do have uh, you, you qu quite an exquisite. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. now you're all aware of my chin. Yeah. If you haven't been before, this is your first time. You know, it's okay. Yeah. You know how she keeps it so thin? So so fit. I said thin and fit. <laughs> thin. Yes. Keep my fins here. Because I was also thinking about she keeps it so fit by doing chin ups. That was terrible. <laughs> Ready? Oh my god. You got tight. You know, that is a conversation in this house, though, is that Susie will not stop talking. I won't. But it's fine. We have, we have, we have things in place for that. Right? Right? Now you was just the kind of girl to break my heart in two. I knew right off when I first kept my eyes on you. But I was hard to know you've been my heroes, too. With your incessant talking. You'll be coming a pest. Rabbit, 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 but you have to keep giving it then. No, you won't stop talking. Why don't you give it a rest? <laughs> You've got more rabbit than science bridge. It's time you got it off your chest. Now you were just a kind of Well, I, I can... I, 
I wonder uh, uh, why Guy Whitey Corngood's mom did not, you know, approve of this track. Is it the timing of when it was played? That's the question. Was it like, Mm. oh, like after I talk to you a lot, like then you go into the office and you blast this song about not talking. I'm definitely going to have to play that when we have company. Susie never lets me get a word in anymore. Stop it. You never let me get a word in either. Whatever. They edited that too really good. <laughs> I hope the husbands in the crowd weren't laughing too hard. You know. <laughs> I wonder if that's how all husbands feel. I'm just, I don't know. I, I'm wondering. So comment below if you think your wife talks too much or not. But don't let your wife see the video comments below. No? Okay. I'm in trouble. Um. Anyway, you had mentioned, uh, I think, on the other anti-Valentine's Day uh, video about wearing pink for Valentine's Day. Mm-hmm. I'm wondering, I should probably change it to a red shirt, right? Wouldn't that be more appropriate? Appropriate? Like Valentine's Day appropriate? Do you feel like you're not... You're or is not it anti-Valentine's Day by not wearing the red? Could be. Hmm. Could be. Should I go black? I don't know. I think yeah. I, I think I might do red, though. I think that might... You you want to? I think so. Mm. Anyway. Thank you so much for that. Thank you guys for hanging out with us. Good hanging out. Hit like and subscribe. Check out the link below. Stay tuned. Stay positive. Love you guys. See you next time. Bye. Bye. I just want to my day.